Hey everyone, so today's video is going to be my fourth video featuring Hot Miami Styles. Um, you guys know I've been talking about this company a long time ago before they ever contacted me about sponsoring. I've spent my own money on clothes from the website and the clothing that I did pick out this time that they did sponsor are clothing that I picked out that I would personally buy myself. So I don't want you guys to think that I'm just doing this video because they're sending me stuff for free. So with that said, this video is going to be cut into two parts. This is going to be part one and it's just going to, I'm just going to hold everything up and try it on for you guys. Um, you know, let you know about the quality, the sizes and all of that. The second part will be how to wear dresses into the fall weather, spring weather and winter weather. Because of course you can wear dresses during the summer. But I wear dresses all year long. I do wear jeans, but I would say about 90% of the year, I wear dresses all year round. So I'm going to make another video after this just showing you guys different ways to wear dresses in cold weather as well. So stay tuned for that. Um, before I try everything on, I just want to mention everything is a size medium. Um, you know, I'm pretty petite up top, but on the bottom, I'm a little more curvy, so... In the past, I used to order a size small from this company, but I just decided to go with a size medium now because my butt's getting even bigger, believe it or not. So um, stay tuned if you want to see all the clothing. Okay, so this is dress number one, and you guys know that I really love dresses that fit you at the waist right here. This dress has like an elastic band that hits you right in the skinniest part of your waist, so it really gives you an hourglass figure. Um, it's a halter top dress with a gray top, it has a zipper that actually does go up and down. And it has this kind of jean material tiered skirt with three layers. In the back it crisscrosses over. And it has these little, I think they're gold, yeah, these little gold studs. And it's a really flattering dress. Um, so the links to all the dresses will be in the sidebar. As far as all the info, the pricing, you can find everything in the sidebar. So here's dress number one. So this one is a little bit similar to the last one that I just showed, but it's more simple. So it's easier to dress up with like chunky jewelry and stuff like that. So this one also has that jean material skirt, but it's more of a stretchy jean material, whereas the other one was a little bit more stiff. Um, just different types of fabric. This one has a white top and it also crisscrosses in the back, but it zippers in the back, unlike the other one. So it has a little silver zipper right there. So this is dress number two, really simple, easy to accessorize and make it look really fancy. So this is one of my absolutely favorite um, dresses from my whole shipment. And that's because the quality of this dress, you can tell, is really, really good. Now, a lot of times dresses like this that are short, they ride up. Every time you take a step, they ride up and up. But since this one is tight around the bottom, it doesn't ride up at all. There's kind of like a trend going on with the dresses that I like. They have this tiered look. And it's really, really flattering to the body. Again, this one also has a silver um, cinched waist right here. And it has a teal top tank top. Um, really, really cute. And these dresses are so simple to just slip on during the summer. Because I don't know about you girls, but I don't like to deal with jeans and like heavy fabric during the winter, during the summertime. So I really like dresses like this that you can just slip on and just go. So the, I'm wearing every single dress with just a simple pair of black heels. And they, it goes with everything. So here's the back, and again, it really hugs onto your curves, so this is dress number three. Okay, so this is dress number four, and this dress is kind of what I think of as a going out dress, whether you're going out to dinner with your boyfriend or going out with your friends. It's a little bit more dressy than the other one. It has like um, a geometrical mod type of pattern to it um, with gray, black, and white, and it's really, really flattering on the body. This dress is the only one that I paired with a pair of Spanx underneath because it's a little bit see-through when the light hits it. But other than that, it's really, really comfortable, easy to just slip into um, for a little bit more fancier day. Or if you're the kind of girl that likes to dress up for, you know, just a normal day, it's fine for that too. So this is dress number four. This is dress number five. And this one is the one I think of a Kim Kardashian inspired dress. This is exactly what I think of in my head. Um, it has like that bandage style skirt to it. Um, it kind of looks like a pencil skirt, two pieces, a, a pencil skirt and a top, but it's all one piece. And this dress is really, really comfortable. Out of all the dresses that I'm trying on for you guys, this is the most comfortable one. Um, so on the top, it has a scoop neck top with short sleeves. And in the back, it has um, this skirt, again, that bandage style. 
subject that really hugs onto your curves and holds onto your curves. So it really makes you look really shapely um, and it accentuates every single curve on your body. This is dress number five. Um, the next dress is actually a bubble hem dress, which is really cute and flirty for summertime and springtime. Um, it has a white beater on top, just a plain white white beater, another cinched waist, and um, a gray linen type skirt. Now this skirt, it's a bubble hem, so which means it kind of puffs out at the bottom, and it has this fabric with a little fold in it. It's actually meant to look a little bit wrinkled. Summertime when you just want to throw something on and go. This is one of my favorites as well. I think I said that about every single one so far. But they're really, really nice, easy, flowy, lightweight dresses that will look nice on any type of body. So, yeah, this is numero six. Dress number seven. Before I start this video, I just want to tell you guys, um, it's the middle of January right now, so I have absolutely no tan. Um, so kind of just excuse that I'm like glowing in the dark right now. Probably like the same color as my dress actually. Anyway, this is the kind of dress that you would wear right in the middle of the summer over a bathing suit. Or if you're going to the beach, um, tanning, you just want to cover up. A lot of times during the summer in New York it gets really hot and you just want to walk around the house with um, basically nothing on. And instead of just putting on a t-shirt or something, it looks cuter to, you know, throw on a really lightweight dress like this one. Um... It's like a white linen material, really light and comfy and flowy. It doesn't stick to your body at all. And it's a piece that you can layer over a bathing suit or wear on its own. So this is dress number eight, and the style is pretty similar to the last one, where it has this kind of smock material on top where it's really, really stretchy, and the bottom part is really loose and flowy. But this one is kind of like a silk material. And this dress is so, so pretty because it has these flowers on it and like the, the colors in it remind me of like a Spanish inspired type of dress. That's really, really pretty. Um, this dress is really, really nice. The dress is, again, like all of them, um, really loose, flowy, doesn't cling to you. This is one of my favorite dresses and I can definitely see myself rocking this a lot during the summertime. So here's the ninth dress and this one my hubby picked out for me. Um, it's another one of like those bandage, or ba bandage, can't even say that word, style dresses. Um, so again, this one really reminds me of a Kim K inspired look too. Really curve hugging on, and this one is a different kind of material. It's more thick than the other dresses. So in my opinion, this dress would be perfect for layering during the winter use. Um, but again, it can be used during the summer as well. So, um, it has this bandage style and it um, goes across the whole body and it has this glittery type of fabric with silver and um, black lines and it has these little glitters in if you can see. Here's the back. Really, really curve hugging. It ties in the back right over here. I don't know if you can see it. It has these little metal crisscross thingies that hold it. And then in the front it has a v-neck line with a little bit of cleavage but not too much. So that is just number nine. Last dress, and this one is, I say that in the beginning of every single one. This is one of my favorite, favorite, favorite dresses ever. If you look at it in the front, it's another one of the bandage style dresses. Purple v-neck. It looks just like a simple dress that you would slip on for a summer day. How cute is the back of this dress? It has like cutout patterns. But it's really, really comfortable. It looks like this dress wouldn't be comfortable, but it's actually really comfortable. It's a beautiful dress. Cotton material, stretchy, very, very comfortable. Um, simple to slip on, just like all the dresses. So yeah, this is the last dress. So stay tuned for the next segment of this video where I'll actually show you girls how to wear these dresses in colder weather. Um, also, I just want to mention for free worldwide shipping, type in the word Chula, C-H-U-L-A, at checkout at Hot Miami Styles, and you will get free shipping anywhere in the world, just like all the other hauls that I've done with the company, same code, same everything. Um, I want to give a big shout out to the whole staff over at Hot Miami Styles. They're the sweetest people ever. If you guys have any questions for them, press the contact us button on their website, and they always write back within a day. Um, if not within a couple of hours. And, um, yeah, thank you guys for watching and I'll see you next time.